And now I'm knackered. Hello, Smeggies. That's right, it's comic book day and the weather isn't exactly brilliant. Let's go to town. At least in freezing. But one thing you don't want on a comic book day is rain. Because you don't want to get your comic book soggy, do you? It's wet, 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 wet. And look, they still haven't finished. I'm always glad for these big bags, that way my comics won't get wet. And there's a lot of wet out there. Yay, Santander have sent me a letter saying this is my free annual multi-trip European travel insurance. I'm not going to Europe this year, that I know of. I take it from the umbrella, it's still raining. Who oh, no. knew? Okay, boys, girls and aliens, I'm going to work now. So I shall not sign off now, but talk to you when I get back in about nine hours-ish. <sighs> I don't want to go to work, I'm feeling tired. I've been editing for the last, I don't know, an hour and a half and... <sighs> I'm seeing a bit. And thus the shift was ended and the weekend begins. And I shall start with... A bottle of beer. Now those of you who know, when you sometimes come with me drinking, it's usually around the Kellam Island area, that's what we call it. It's basically, there's a museum called Kellam Island in Sheffield, and there are a couple of pubs around that museum. And the thing with that museum is that they have their own brewery, and so they have their own beers, and those pubs serve them. What I didn't know was Asda sold them in bottles. So when I was there Tuesday night, I bought four different ones. This one's, I'm assuming, Kellam Myland, the original. Shall I show you what it looks like in a glass? Ta-da! I don't think this is the original. Let me just try it. Yeah, it is. What, well, I'm thirsty. For those of you who live in Sheffield and enjoy a beer, I suggest you get some Kellam Island down your Easy Rider or Pale Rider or whatever else they have. My mouth's watering now. And for those of you who've never been to Sheffield and end up visiting there for a drinking session, forget all the big pubs in like West Street and all them. They're just, it's where all the students go. You want to go down to Kellam Island area. Brilliant pubs, brilliant atmosphere, brilliant drink. I sound like an advertisement. So I'm home now and I think I'm going to do some more editing. Yeah. Anybody think I'm drunk already? And funnily enough, I'm not hungry yet. Might have something to do with I had a McDonald's for tea. I don't know why I'm hitting myself on the chin. With my finger. I'm not an alcoholic or anything, but I want a bottle number two. <laughs> do you want to see something weird? Almost finished editing all the clips together, but... Can you tell what's missing? It seems very strange watching it without any sound effects, without any music. <laughs> it's really, really bizarre. But I'm really liking this episode, it's uh, really, really good. It's just a completely nuts episode, and I said that at the beginning of the week, that when I came up with it, that this is going to be just a completely nuts episode. Yeah, you should have seen it by now, if you've not, you know, at the end of this video. In fact, right now, there should be a link to this episode right here on this box. I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm going nuts. It's 10 to 1 in the morning? What? When did that happen? Well, obviously, it's happened net just this minute, but when did it get past midnight? That's what I don't know. I, you know okay, I'm going. Yeah. Until later on today. I keep hurting myself doing that. Peace out. I'm going to end up being a right bruise on here soon. <laughs>